buzzing. I feel honoured, I feel privileged to be stepping out for Sheffield FC, the world's first football team. I feel like this is what I'm meant to do. People feel like, because I tell jokes, I'm a joke man, they don't understand I'm a serious baller. Like, I'm a footballer first. I'm not a comedian who likes football, no. I'm a footballer. Comedy is just my side thing. Today I'm going to show everyone how much of a baller I am and I can't wait to go out there. My striker. I can't believe this is happening. I didn't get into show business for this, man. Oh my days. This is crazy, bro. I'm going to stand in front of you. Oh, man. I'm Andrew Mensah, and welcome to my stand up kickabout, a show where I tour the UK. Was an attractor, baby? I was made for this life. Combining my two big passions football yeah! and stand up. I'll be stopping by some of the most interesting and unique football clubs to meet the teams, <laughs> managers, Jaffa, get me on the veterans team, <laughs> and fans. We go. Before hosting a comedy night with a local comedian. <laughs> this week, I leave the ends to find out about Sheffield FC. What time do you call this, Andrew? Who, founded in 1857, are the world's first football club. It was the wrong decision. <laughs> and creators of some of the rules we still play today. <laughs> yes, Sheffield. <laughs> How are we doing? We good? We're good. Yeah. We're good. It's my first time in Sheffield, man. We couldn't do a football show without coming to the home of football. If that makes sense, and that's why we're in Sheffield. <laughs> So, I've got the directors here. Are you proud of being the first club? Absolutely. So, 1857. And when were you born? A bit after that, but it feels <laughs> like 1857. I've been being chairman for 24 years. 24 years? Yeah, a lifetime. That's a, that is a lifetime. I'm 28, so you started when I was four. Yeah. That's good maths. Um, <laughs> so, 24 years, and you never thought, like, I want to move on from here. I'm not. Oh, often, yeah. Often. <laughs> you say this year that Sheffield birthed football, but you also birthed Harry Maguire, so it's like, cancel that out, do you know what I mean? <laughs> Richard, good to see you. Nice to see you. How did it all begin? Well, it began uh, via cricket. So we had a, a... Our forefather was a cricketer, played ball games in universities, and looked for a recreation to keep themselves fit for the gentleman's sport of cricket. And they came together and formed a common set of laws by which the game developed to today. OK, cool. So, a question I've got for you, yeah, is if this was the first football club, who did you play? So, in 1857, it was a members' organisation. They played first letters of the alphabet against second letters of the alphabet. Married men against unmarried men. Where I'm from, we used to do blacks versus whites. It wasn't a racial thing, we just couldn't afford bibs. <laughs> so, yeah. Obviously, this is such a historic club, and it's the birthplace of football. This talks to me about the kind of clubs and the people that you've brushed shoulders with. In our 150th year, we managed to get a game against Inter Milan. Mario Balotelli made his debut in the UK against Sheffield No FC. way! Yeah, Pally came and introduced the teams. Wow. So we'd got, you know, painters and decorators and World Cup winners <laughs> all getting met by Pele. That's crazy. Now, I heard that Sheffield FC are responsible for the original rules of football. We have a copy here of yes. the first printed version from 1859. And although some of the rules have changed, because we didn't start with VAR and offside, of course, <laughs> um, but we shall kick off from the middle. We invented crossbars, corner kicks, free kicks. So we've got a few football challenges to see, see how you would match up with our ancestors. <laughs> yes! Same robot. Benny, my boy, Good. what's going on, man? Yeah, so I actually dressed like a Victorian footballer today and the outfit is whack. Kind of look like I'm playing cricket, half cricket, half football. I've got the socks off, I've got the boots, I've got a hat backwards. I just try to swag it up as much as I can, but... It's, it's, not, it's not a good look still. It don't matter what I'm wearing, yeah. I'm a footballer. All so right, bro, right. I heard you got some challenges for me. Yeah, I'm yeah. on trial, you know? So if I beat you, bro, you it's, it's position. this thing. Yeah, yeah. bro, it's, uh, it's my thing. First challenge is the crossbar challenge, because um, Sheffield FC invented it, so. I can't lie, this is my bread and butter. Be ready. All right, let's, let's do this. You're up first. The cameras are watching, bro, no pressure. 
All right, that's one. <laughs> oh, he's hit it. Oh. I don't think you've got consistency still. Do we take those? Do we take those? <laughs> oh my god! I can't believe it! Oh. It's not about how you start, it's about how you finish still. <laughs> you started and finished the same. <laughs> what do you mean? What people didn't see is that actually I hit the crossbar before the cameras were rolling. And not only did I hit the crossbar, I hit the crossbar back to back. As in, I slapped it in, boom. Then the ball came out again. I said, should I hit it again? Everyone was like, yeah, go on. And I hit it again. It doesn't matter. Once the cameras come on, that's when you need to perform, innit? So next challenge, what are we doing? Talk to me. Well, Chef FC created the free kick, so we're going to have one free kick here and one there. All right, you're up, bro. Let's go. Oh. I'm thinking about it to stick to his right foot. <laughs> Ooh. Wrong game. It's the wrong game I'm playing. <laughs> okay, you're going top left. Oh, no, that's poor. Get it <laughs> off the ground, buddy. <laughs> Watch this. Let's go top bit. What did I? Oh, my days. Wrong challenge. Next challenge. What are we doing? Well, Shepherd FC created the corner, trying to get it straight in. Yeah? Let's go. Man just did it straight away, bro. Give me a chance, bro. Oh, my days. Last one, yeah? <laughs> Football's hard, I can't even lie. Oh, he's got it. Ooh. <laughs> I'll give you that. Hey. hey. <laughs> I can lose gracefully, at least. I think a good manager will see the potential in me. If Pep saw me today, he would know there's potential for greatness. 